Hello guys, Ryan Rakowski here, and today I want to show you some of my GoPro equipment. And, well, you're probably thinking, Ryan, don't just show us a plastic GoPro case. What do you got in store for us? Well, I want to show you some of my custom GoPro gear. So, we have right here with us the original case that came with the GoPro Hero 4 Black. I have the, the opening back door to allow for better sound. But what if you want to have even better sound and even better picture? Because this GoPro is shooting through a pretty, it's, a, it's like a piece of plastic, but the, the plastic could distort our image if you want to be really technical. I have a custom made Hero 4 Black 3D printed case. So the way it works is there's a little clip right here and you push the GoPro up and then you sort of slide it back until it locks into place. Now this is very, very sweet. This, uh, it feels cheap in a way, but it's not. Um, it costed me about $7 and it's sturdy and it holds the GoPro into place, like it doesn't move. Um, there's holes for all of the buttons, and it even has the back part or the bottom part to hold or clip on to any mount that you desire. And sure, Ryan, that's that's pretty awesome. Well, yeah, it's awesome. Now I can have better sound and better video. But Ryan, doesn't this make your camera vulnerable to certain things? Well, you're right, it does make it vulnerable, but that's why I have a custom GoPro lens cap that I also printed with my case to put on. So the way it works is it's pretty simple. You just set it down there and push down just a slight bit. The protective lens cap is slightly too small, so if you put it on there too much, It'll lock it into place, so you don't want to put it on too much, but it's all about finding a happy medium so it can stay on there without falling off. I had this entire setup along with my chesty mount. My chesty mount is right here, so I just had it on here. I had this entire set attached to my chest while I graduated. You can see the video right here. If you guys are interested in doing this for yourself, I don't know where you guys can find 3D printers. I managed to get lucky and have one at my college, university, and I printed this off while I was while I was a student. The uh, the materials costed about seven dollars, and then that's the uh, the flat fee because it was actually under the amount of grams that it was needed to print, and then. I believe it's after every five grams, it's another extra dollar or something. So it could get pricey depending on what you do. I'll put in the description a link to where I found the GoPro case and lens cap. Um, I forgot where exactly, but it's a pretty cool place where you can print off any type of 3D model. And this is just one example of what 3D modeling can do. Um, I think it's pretty sweet. And I just wanted to share this with you guys. So thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys later.